Greetings, my name is Ashama Ruth Nicole Bander and I trade under the name Kayla Justin as an actress and poet at Center for Talent Development. In the past few months we have been in a project called Youth Artpreneurship Project which has taught us how to use our talents and our crafts to make a better impact in our society, especially in our environment, because we have learned that how um, global warming, climate change, and all the other diverse effects of our environment are caused by our actions, which are harmful to our environment. So we have learned how to use um, upcycled materials, for example, tires, to make crafts that can be beautiful, beautify our homes, that we can sell and monetize for our interests. And we also learned how to use um, recycled paper, recycled plastic to make beautiful crafts for even the children at home that they can use to play with, um, make your own piggy bank using a bottle. It has been a wonderful journey and we're very proud to say that we have learned quite a number of things. Not only that, we have also learned that our art, our music, our poetry, our act can be used to spread stories regarding this very, very severe, critical, delicate topics that will help us better our environment. We hope we can have such an opportunity again next time, but for now... Hi, my name is Mileto Machazi Bimbe and um, I'm one of the participants that were involved in the Youth Entrepreneurship Project. Besides this, I'm also a poet and public speaker. So about our amazing project, our project was mainly focused on going green, wireless teaching young people about entrepreneurial skills. So during the entire course of our program, we did a lot of upcycling, taking old things and turning it into something that can be used and that can be sold. Our journey was really, really amazing. We got to also work with facilitators from America, the likes of DJ Don P and Mr. Joba Nguenya. Um, we really got to interact as young people. We also had artists on board. So here and there, people also created things like poetry and dances and plays based on climate change and environmental protection because that's what our project was really about, teaching people how to take care of the environment whilst making cash. So it has been a really, really amazing journey and any time I would really like to do this again. Thank you. Hello everyone. So my name is Nadia Siddiqui and I'm a graphic designer and I'm also one of the youths who was involved in the Youth Entrepreneurship Project. So on top of that, I'm looking to major into dental hygiene. So as we were doing this Youth Entrepreneurship Project, we came up with different products and these include chairs, the tables, and some tables have the square topping and others have a, you know, a circle topping. So on top of that, we're looking to come up with other things. As you can see, there are other tires that are not yet Yet made into products so we're looking to make other things and we're becoming innovative in our creations because at the end of the day creation needs to be innovative hi everyone my name is Fatai Joshe I'm one of the students from this project and um, I'm an actress by the way yes um, so going forward we want to create a uh, more of these we want to turn trash into treasure like creating opportunities for young people and as you all know uh, some of you know that in this city it's hard for some people to find jobs and who knows maybe after some time we may have our own, our own company to have all of these and some people to create their own project from this company. Now, as the project commenced, there are a lot of things that we encountered. For example, we did not have the skills to create this beautiful thing, and we did not have the, the workload for all these things. We did not have enough people to come through, and we also didn't have enough materials. So I feel that as we grow, we might be able to do better, to do more, to explore more of these creations these creations, create more things, upcycle more things. And I believe that this experience will help us also teach other people to create these beautiful artifacts using trash.